Guys, the time has come to unbox my updated game. So this is Epic Underworld set one and set two. So I redid all the packaging because I got Photoshop now, so all the cards will be looking way more professional. I'm sorry for all these little parts, these booster packs um, kind of, as you can see, they kind of peel. So I might start switching to the uh, hook boxes soon for packs, but as of right now, they're fine. Um, but I think we're going to start with set one because it's like the OG set. No, let's start with set two because uh, I believe the set one art is better just because I had to redo all of it. So it's definitely going to be better if I did it more recently. But I'm definitely looking for, um, from set two, I'm looking for more copies of DinoCon, um, Wicker Wizard. I mean, Old Lighthouse is always good to get, I guess. Um, yeah, Epic Underworlds. Uh, this will be on the TCG sale if I can get it up there in time um so you guys can pick up some packs if you want and then in the next video we'll open the pcg expansion pack and then the shank tank starter deck but yeah old lighthouse lost tokus mech super good card actually um it's kind of like a mini spike serpent in the sense of its ability destroyer mech flow bane amethyst golem a fan art card by sinister productions unknown valkyrie dark knight sword this is the first time i've ever pulled this it's a new comeback card it's kind of annoying arctic horror Sand Ghost, another Arctic Core. I mean, that's not bad. Whoa, that card was upside down. Swamp Hunter, Alamont Mech. Okay, this is weird. <laughs> uh, Magic Bolt, Spidorial Bot, M Monster Summoners, another Swamp Hunter, Teristo, and Slate Serpent. Okay, that pack, not gonna lie, that was a little sketchy. I've never got, like, more than one duplicate ever in an Epic Underworlds pack, so... I don't know, and all the cards were upside down? That's kind of sketchy, but... Still, we got a pretty good card. We got Amethyst Golem. Let's look at our rares that we got. Unknown Valkyrie. Arctic Horror. Another Arctic Horror. And Magic Bolt. And then, yeah, we got all of these cards. So, I'm really happy we got Slate Serpent. Very nice. Um, Magic Bolt isn't the best rare. It's I think it's way too expensive. Arctic Horror, really good card for no ability decks and just in general. And Unknown Valkyrie. Good support for the unknown archetype. Maybe just a little too expensive. But other than that, very good pulls. Overall, set two isn't as powerful as set one, set three, or set four. But I, of course, I haven't finished set four. Um, but, but just based on the cards I've made so far. Um, set two, if you guys were going to get any packs, I recommend getting set one, set three, or set four. Of course, only set one and set two are up. Um, but yeah, set one has all the classic... What the heck was that rip? has all the classic cards. Jeez. That was kind of harsh. All right, let's see what we get. Nice, we got a classic grapple gun. This was remade from Epic Wars TCG, my old TCG. Unknown Beam, really good staple card. Tasmi the Great, this has proven to be a decent card. The Last Defense. I made it cheaper, so now it's actually, people might actually use it. Dino of the Clouds. Combat Engineer, super good pull. Mushroom Shield. Turret Joe, nobody's ever really used this card. No, sorry, I had to sneeze there. Okay, uh, Kobe and Archer. It's actually a decent draw support. Basically, whenever it kills a card, you draw a card. Drink of the Dragon. Curse of Grim. No way, we got Zormax. Guys, we got Zormax. I'm so happy with this pull right now. Best pull of the day. Um, but as you can see, like I had to redo a lot of these artworks. So all of them have like cool backgrounds, I guess. Tortal Warrior, Bull of Power, Battlehorn, Decent Card, and Dark Wisp. Well, that, that was a great pack for set one. Definitely happy with everything. I just can't wait to unbox set three because that's when we have the huge fan art contest with like 10 fan art cards in it. So it's going to be a big set. Um, but super excited that um, we got Zormax. Um, and yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this Epic Underworlds pack opening. And I'll see you in the next one.